only cared about the technology, not the business. Yes, I knew it was strange, and no, I didn't. I didn't. Get in there and help him. Or do you just plan to let him die? What is up, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? It's Zig and Bagel here, and welcome back to another episode of Star Wars The Old Republic. Thank you for joining me today. Don't forget to tap that like button, and if you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. All right, we are back with more Star Wars, and I am in the Rishi Stronghold. I've done a little bit of work on it. Uh, I got the whole starting area here set up with a galactic trade network. We got our banks and just a little bit of decor. So uh, some benches you can sit at. Some uh, of the, what do you call it, the like harvesting nodes. So we can come over here and harvest some cre uh, crystals if we want to. And, oh wow, yeah, it takes a long time, like 15 seconds to harvest one, but we'll get that in here in just a second, and ta-da, we got some crystal. Sweet. Well, uh, also, okay, we entered the, uh, the PvP zone, got a little, uh, some flags up here, got some decorating over on this side, just a little bit, getting things started kind of in the main area, place right around All here. Right. make me look good. Okay, I try. Uh, we got a jukebox here, so we play something. Is, is something gonna play? I don't hear anything playing. Come on, play something. Okay, I guess it doesn't want to play something right now. All good though. We got another jukebox in the main area over here. I got some flags up, so we got our Empire and Republic flags up, because this area is open up for uh, opened up for everyone. And I do want to show you if we go to the Stronghold section. I have opened up our Rishi Stronghold, the Zig and Bagels Galactic Stronghold, to the public. It is open for public. I'm just trying to see how we can do invite uh, or how you can find it, because I'm not really sure. Yes, uh, public listing, everyone, owner Zig and Bagel, Galactic Stronghold, enable Stronghold PvP is all ready. So not really sure how you can find it, but it is open. So if you want to come hang out in the Rishi Stronghold of mine, then you can go ahead and do that. So yeah, I just wanted to come and start off this episode by showing you guys what I've done so far in the Rishi Stronghold. We're going to work on doing more of it together in the future once we unlock some more stuff. I do have quite a bit uh, already ready to unlock, but I'd love to hear some ideas about kind of some areas to set up, like maybe a good area in the Rishi Stronghold to have is kind of our cantina. If you can tell me a good place for that, I will uh, work on setting it up. So yeah. I'm going to go ahead and bring you guys back in here in a little bit, just to right from where we left off for our missions on Nar Shaddaa. All right, guys, we are back on Nar Shaddaa in the Duros and Red Light sector. Pretty nice. Uh, we do have some mail, so I want to check that real quick, see if we have anything good. This looks like, yep, that is spam. Uh, report messages, spam or harassment? Yes, spam. There we go. Thank you for submitting your ticket. Gotcha. So, Mario Vahen, your assistance crushing the exchange's campaign against the Empire, has been communicated to the Diplomatic Service leadership. We are currently recognizing, uh, reorganizing Narshada's Shadow Syndicate into a more useful configuration for our future interests. Uh, Varko Nai has proven highly compliment, uh, what? That sounds weird. Has proven highly, uh, complaint and prove, uh, provided us numerous negoti negotiating advantages while the DX Annihilator Network has been put to work removing various targets in our path. Uh, Godoba the Hut 
main investigator of the Shadow Syndicate's betrayal of us, remains within our custody. His humiliation sets an example for the others, but he is not through serving us. The attached gift was liberated from uh, Narco's private resources. I felt you deserved it most. So 358 uh, uh, credits here. Take our credits. Oh yeah. Good old credits. Let's go ahead and mount up here. Just like this. I like jumping off onto this guy and then down. And we gotta go in this direction. Not sure where we would pick up any further Narshada missions. I haven't seen them. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, so we'll be looking out to see if there are more Narshada missions. You would think there are more for the, the main storyline here, but I don't see it yet. Okay. Where do we go from here? Oh, yep, looks like we got to pick one up in the Intelligence Center. Intelligence Post Drazel. Right here. So let's go pick up our planetary quest. I'm guessing that's what this is. Just check on it real quick. Where are you? Agent... Huh. Not really sure. It is purple. It doesn't say it's uh, a planetary one, though, but I think we'll just pick it up anyway. It is one for this sector. Greetings. I heard of your success with the Shadow Syndicate. I was hoping you might put those talents to work for me. My okay. name is Mardel Felth, Imperial Intelligence, and I am here to stop a revolution. Uh, you need help? Is that a joke? Uh, you think I'd be interested? Uh, you need help? I've been known to stop or start a few wars in my day. They call this place the Duros Sector. But it's not just Duros who live here. Alien refugees from across the galaxy have fled here. Fled from us. Now a leader has emerged to unite the different species. They call him the Flame. And we have killed him twice. Each time he reappears. The locals claim he's immortal. Hmm. You want me to try again? <laughs> immortal? I think I'll pass. Uh, you want me to try again? Third time's the charm. Only the Emperor himself can claim true immortality. But I'm not asking you to kill the flame. Yet. Our only undercover agent in his gang was recently discovered and murdered. The flame insisted the corpse be publicly displayed in Ranamas Square to taunt us. Okay, sounds like a trap. Is there more to this? Uh, don't expect me to cry. Uh, sounds like a trap. If they're baiting you, they want something. Oh, there's no doubt it's a trap. But they have bait we're hard-pressed to resist. Everything our agent found, all his notes, are pinned to the corpse in plain view. But every team I've sent to retrieve the records has come back in pieces. You may be the only one who could walk into this trap and survive. Okay, uh, you sound nervous. What's it worth to you? Or you're a fuel, a, f a fuel, you're a fool. Uh, you sound nervous. This corpse has been there for days, right? What's so urgent now? I should know better than to try to get anything by you. Admiral Jafand Ange arrives today to discuss this problem with the huts. My job is on the line. Once you have the records, use this on the body to burn it. We can't have them use one of our own as a rallying point. Okay, sounds good. So, yeah, I think this is the continuation for the planetary quest since they brought up the shadow syndicate uh, again so let's head outside actually <clears throat> excuse me let's claim this post here just make sure we got it yep we do you and me sounds good which direction okay we still got to head Way over there. Wait, I go in the wrong. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. Awesome. We got to go this direction. So yeah, I want to make sure to say that I hope you're having a great day. My day's going quite well, and I do hope you enjoy this episode. Uh, try to get at least these two missions done for today: the contract negotiations and dead drop. And then we'll move on from here. Okay. 
got past those guys without even uh, alerting them always makes me happy okay um just trying to think here what we want to try to do first we're right by the uh, contract negotiations so we might as well get things started for it let's come over here and try to sneak past let's uh cloak up hello you can't see me even though my cloak uh is kind of bugging out right now and i can still see myself let's walk in oh okay so use the bio scanner hello anti-empire renegade leader Stabby stab. Stabby stab again. All right, make me he bombed. Oh yeah. Very good. We should be able to level up at least once in this episode from the missions. I can imagine. It's a uh, dart people. Get you darted as well. Oh. That's why I couldn't stab this guy, because I didn't have him targeted. Oh, that guy's already dead. And so are you. All taken care of. We got five more of those guys for the bonus. Let's, uh, activate that. Hello. Goodbye. Stabby stab. Stabby stab again. Get knifed. Wow, I thought I could have stabbed them from really far away there for a sec. Because they're showing I could. For just a moment. We need two more guys down. And we will be good. Which direction do we need? Okay, we need to head over here anyway. So we can take out these two guys. Dart. And dart. And three. Get knife. Get knife, everyone. And let's make sure to stab you, then we can tackle advantage to dead. Yay! So use the bio scanner. Ah, it's this guy. Kind of a small little thing to click on. Retrieving data. What do we got? Anything good? It's working. Okay, retrieve the cyclone sample. Retrieving, and use your personal holocam. What do we got? Hello again, Cypher. Oh, watch your seeing everything the bioscan sees. Genetic bonding agents, molecular webs. Pure. Perfect. Take Cyclone, and it becomes you. I'm going deeper now, Cypher. Looking for a signature to tell us who the artist is. Curious? Uh, sure. I'm curious. The artist? Uh, only if it helps us. Uh, sure, I'm curious. I'll play along. What have you found? I have a corporate match. Cyclone's coding process is registered to Synchet Industries. Synchet used to manufacture droids, food supplements, medical supplies. But Synchet declared bankruptcy five years ago. The company is gone. Okay, what? Not entirely, it seems. Or you messed up. Uh, not entirely, it seems. Someone else must be using their technology. Synchet, a dead company, is connected to Cyclone. Cyclone is connected to the Terror Cell. We need more. I'm finding one former Synchet executive currently on Nar Shaddaa. He left the company just before it dissolved. Question him about Synchet. We need to know what happened to their resources, whether they had terrorist connections. Okay, he'll talk to me. I'll do it, or he better hope he's, uh, innocent. Uh, he'll talk to me. Yeah, he definitely will. Shouldn't be hard to interrogate a rich businessman. Your executive is named Jordal Tlan. Rich, eccentric, reclusive. Stays in his private casino lounge. Only associates with droids. No visitors allowed, no weapons allowed. He'll need a reason to talk to you, to be desperate to talk to you. Okay, what are you thinking? That doesn't sound good. Or what's our leverage? Uh, what are you thinking? I assume you have something in mind. Use the resources you have. See those medical crates. 
Combine their chemicals correctly and you'll have an undetectable poison. Clown's serving droids won't notice if you poison his drink. When he sweats and chokes, offer the antidote in return for cooperation. Okay, I'll keep my options open. Good thinking, or that's sick. I'll keep my options open. I'll do what I have to, but I make the call myself. If you like. I'm sending the formulas for poison and antidote. The important thing is to get to Tlan. Get him talking about the terrorists, Cyclone, and the dissolution of Sinchet. Okay, sounds good. Collect medical equipment. Right over here. Oh, I'm gonna have to take out these guys, I guess, to get the medical equipment. So let's do this real quick. Get darted. Get darted. And let's start you two. Stabby stab. Oh yeah. Love giving you guys the stabby stab. And... Knifey knife. You're trying to shoot me? I stab you. In the face. Okay, take the medical crate of chemicals. Mix and retrieve chemicals at the med station, which is right over here. So yeah, it's pretty much forcing us to take out everyone here. Grenade out. You out. Tactical advantage. Tactical advantage. Like so. Okay. So, so far some fun missions here, definitely enjoying it. Uh, I can't wait to get off Narshada though, it's, uh, it's kind of cool looking, but it, it, I mean, I like the wide open uh, planets a lot more that aren't just like an entire disgusting cityscape. And, oh, what? Mix and retrieve chemicals at the med station. I guess I re gotta retrieve them now. Okay, go to Jarrell uh, Talan's lounge. We will do that after we get the dead drop one taken care of. But I do think I just want to take care of this epic just because some good XP from taking these guys out. <clears throat> Excuse me. Back in advantage on them. Uh, stabby stab. Get stabbed. Oh yeah, interrupted whatever his ability was there. Um, guard again. Keep our guard up. And he's dead. Man, we didn't Rise lose like any health on that. <clears throat> Pretty awesome. Let me check on the map. Oh yeah, because uh, his uh, lounge is near the main promenade. So let's move on here, and I think I'm going to go ahead and bring you guys back in when we arrive at the next mission, Dead Drop. It's not too, too far away, but I don't want to just make you wait as I walk around this place, so I will bring you back in just a moment. Alright, we are back, and I'm pretty sure for this mission we got to take out some guys, so I think we're just going to start here. And find out if we really need to. So let's do some stabby stabs. Like this. Hmm. I guess we don't need to worry about you then. We'll just head down to the body and take Bunch care of, of it. Come on. But I can shoot more of them than you. Bunch of losers, okay. Oh, look at him. Hello there, guy. Uh let's let's Go ahead and dispose of your body. Say goodbye. Oh no, it's a trap. It's a trap. The flames assassin. Uh, get stabbed. Okay, I'm electrocuted. Stabby stab. Wait, what? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? You can't run away from me. Up oh, there he is. Okay, now we can tackle advantage a bit. And... You're dead. Goodbye, assassin. Just like that. Okay, alien insider. 
So it looks like we just got to return to Agent Madel Fay <clears throat> over in the intelligence post. Let's just go ahead and quick travel there to turn in Dead Drop. And then we're going to head over to the Jador to Land's Lounge mission and get that one done. So let's see what Agent Metal uh, Fail, however you say your name, has to say about us completing this mission. Your trap's been sprung. Here are the notes. Let me see. Blasted rebels. The Flame is planning an attack on Admiral Jafand Ange. He can't know about this. I was supposed to... What exactly would you prefer? I didn't know. Admiral Jafand? Sir, I apologize. This is... I know who you are. You have made quite a reputation for yourself in the right circles. Thank are you, you more inclined than Agent Maddell to tell me what threat has just been posed? Does this come from the flame? Uh, he wants to kill you. What's it worth to you? Or was it that obvious? Uh, he wants to kill you. Any idea why he'd have it in for you, personally? The flame must know I've been communicating with the hut. I'm here to tell them the Empire will withdraw billions of credits of business from Nar Shaddaa unless they shut down this rebellion. Hmm. Which makes you a target? Is that an offer... Is that offer open to anyone? Uh, will they agree? Um, <clears> hmm. <throat> uh, which makes you a target, yeah. Killing you would be quite a coup for the flame. We must teach him the folly of targeting the Empire. Yes. I invite you to come with me when I meet with the huts. Your activities have made an impression on the cartel. Uh, standard agreement then. Give me the, give me details. I'm nobody's hanger on. What? Hanger on? It's a weird thing to say. Uh, standard arrangement then. You do the talking, I'll keep an eye on what's happening behind the scenes. I see you've done this before. If you're interested, I suggest you go first to flush out and destroy any of these rebels who might lie in wait. I leave for my meeting shortly. I hope to see you there. Knowing Admiral Jafand, I'd suggest you go now. He'll expect the route to his meeting to be cleared before he leaves. Okay, sounds good. We got an earpiece from that one. 450 influence for, uh, from Kaleo. Awesome, awesome. Oh yeah, we're really close to leveling up now. Uh, do we have... Oh yeah, we already do have an earpiece. Is this one better? Ah, it is. Let's stick you in there. Me? 38, 54. Let's check on what Kaleo has on her right now. This is a level 50. She has 42. Mastery Endurance. Yes, and you're level 50. That's 46. Go ahead and put these brand new pants on. Ooh, those are a little bit better. What I really want is a new top piece for her. And she doesn't have a place for ears. Sounds good. All taken care of there from the gear. Uh, so now we got to head over to... Well, yeah, we're not going to worry about the flame just yet. We'll probably take care of that in the next episode. I want to head over here for contract negotiations. To talk, uh, to go to Jardel Talan's lounge. Let's see if we can't transport there. Yeah, promenade right here. Nothing like a good quick travel to make things better. So let's get there. Okay, the promenade. And where exactly the promenade do I need to go? Let's actually check on you. Pads are currently open for business. Oh yeah, we actually have to go to the casino. Have a safe so let's go for stay. a fly to the casino, which is right up there. Big floating casino. Shouldn't be too far. Or wait, is it that one? It might be that one actually. Yeah. Pre I can't really tell. Could be either one. Are you are you gonna turn at the last second? 
Nah, looks like we're going into this guy right here. Oh, yeah. Welcome to the casino. Casino Royale. And we have arrived at the Star Cluster Co Casino. All right, make me look good. I tried to, Kaleo. And there's all kinds of cool mounts here. I'm trying to see. I thought there were ways you could actually try to win some of these, but I can't remember exactly. We gotta head up top. And where exactly are we going? Okay. Through here, and we gotta go to the right side to enter for this mission. You and me? So yeah, I'd love to hear what you're thinking of the Star Wars The Old Republic series so far. If there's anything you'd like me to try to do uh, during this series, let me know in the comment section down below. And I'd love to hear about uh, kind of some ideas for the Rishi Stronghold. <clears throat> some uh, like what type of uh, good decorations should be good for certain areas of the map. Oh, Master we're going in. Blanc requested my repairs be completed in time for tomorrow's swoop race broadcast. You are supposed to comply. I'm not a mechanic. I can't keep repairing you things when you malfunction. Then I shall inform Master Tuan of your inability to perform your duties. That's not necessary. I... Why don't you clear your memory of the last five minutes? Hey, you... I, this is Master Tuan's lounge. Is there something I can help you with? Um, having droid problems? Hello there, or Master Talan? Uh, having droid problems? You've got your hands full with that protocol unit. It's nothing big. Master Talan just likes everything to be perfect. The JTO2 is a Geonosian antique. JTO3's blasters need recalibration. The serving droid spills drinks. Okay, let me see them. Sorry to hear it, or stop whining. Uh, let me, let's see, let me see them. The droids are why I'm here. Do you mind? Mm, what do you want? Master Talon didn't say anyone was coming. Uh, I'm with maintenance. Management sent me. Or call it shopping. Uh, management sent me. This is hot cartel business. Droids need to be checked for security. What? I didn't think you were... Ugh, sorry. I don't know what you expect to find in the serving droid, but yes, go ahead. Master Chalon has nothing to hide. Okay, sounds good. So, uh, poison right, JTO5's drink dispenser. Yeah. This appears to be an advanced model serving droid. It shouldn't be difficult to add the poison into its drink dispenser. Poison the droid's drinks, leave the droid alone. Poison the droids drinks. Sorry, Master Slan must have called the droid. I hope that's not a problem. No problem. This should be interesting. Or I can wait. Um, I can wait. No rush. I'll take another look when it gets back. That's fine with me. Sounds good. Atula. Natula, I can't breathe. I need my medical droids. I need them now. Master, you have two medical droids already. Idiot girl, I know when there's something wrong with me. I can't breathe. My tongue is swelling. There was something in my drink. Uh, I'm responsible. I can help you. Or thought I thought you'd notice that. Uh, I can help you. Let me in. I'm a doctor. Who the blazes are you? I'm sorry, Master. He came to look at the droids. You pathetic creature, I told you that I have enemies and this is proof. This man is trying to kill me. I'm so sorry. I had no idea. You've got my undivided attention, Blast. You know, what do you want? Uh, it's about your business. Tell me about this serum, or terrorist scum. Uh, it's about your business. I need to know about Sinchet's link to terrorism. It's not... Uh, it wasn't like that. Back when I was with Sinchet, the company was failing. The war bankrupted us, so we had to sell everything. One of our subsidiaries developed medical technologies, Coltor tanks, Rancor stems, Cyclone, that sort of thing. But the group that bought it wasn't interested in profit. 
Okay, go on. You dealt with this group? Or you're making me happy? Uh, go on. What were they interested in? They used fake names. Paid for everything in, in cash. They only cared about the technology, not the business. Yes, I knew it was strange, and no, I didn't. I didn't. <laughs> Get in there and help him. Or do you just plan to let him die? Uh, not yet. Don't worry. Or there's more I can do to him. Uh, not yet. I'll bring him the antidote. Open the door. Okay, administer the antidote to Jarell Tlan. Oh, nope, that was the exit. Um, wait. Ah, over here. Alright, make me look good. High roller, gambler. This is his own little uh, private casino area back here. I thought he didn't like people, so why were there people in there? Hello? I can breathe. I can breathe again. Thank you. Alert. Life signs stabilized. Warning. Any stress or exertion is inadvisable. No more, all right? No more. I'll, I'll tell you everything if you'll just... Just go. Okay, start talking. You'll be okay, or we'll see. Uh, start talking. Finish your story, Tom. Like I told you, Sinshat sold its medical division, Vervgen, to a group of men who kept their identity secret. They were especially interested in Vervgen's genetic modification serums. They might still be running the company, I, I don't know for sure. Okay, you don't know. Anything else on them? Or don't play with me. Uh, anything else on them? Any idea what Vervgen is up to? Not really. I heard something about a cyclone trial. Maybe the company is looking to produce and sell a new batch. Vervgen used to be headquartered in the upper levels. I don't know if you care, but the building's not even there anymore. But whatever Vervgen and its owners are doing, I'm not involved. All right. I'll be watching you, or ha <laughs> ha, idiot. I'll be watching you. Stay out of trouble, or I'll be back. You ever come here again, I'll be ready. Sure. I will kill you. Let's uh, use our personal hollow communicator and see what's got to say. What do we got? Okay, here Hello, we go. Cypher. Always pleasant to speak. Sure. You know, I managed to slice into the star cluster's holocams. I got to see how you handle field work. Your questioning of Jordal Clan was adeptly handled. You should try torturing people more often. Uh, can we move on? It was necessary, or it wasn't torture, exactly. Uh, it wasn't torture, exactly. The poisoning clan was blackmail, nothing more, nothing less. An important distinction. I apologize. So, now we know about Vervgen, a Sinchet Industries medical subsidiary purchased by a shadowy group of buyers. Those buyers were presumably members of the Terra Cell. The company was acquired to produce Cyclone and other technologies. Agreed. How is that possible? Or they're our next target. Uh, agreed. I reached the same conclusion. I've located the Vergen offices, but I'm unable to obtain personnel records. Their data is very well secured. I need you to set up surveillance. Slice into public terminals around the building perimeter. And I can use Holonet resources to see and hear inside. Okay, and after that... All right... We should attack now. Uh, and after that? Say we're successful. Then what? We analyze the situation. Determine our best approach. Vervgen is located in the upper level industrial sites. The sector is overrun by corporate security. Some may carry Cyclone as a last resort. When you're done, come to Shadow Town. We'll meet in person. Watch your X out. All right, sounds good. Man, I didn't realize that there was going to be even more to contract negotiation. So where do we need to head to exactly? Industrial sector, maybe? Not really sure. Let's head outside, and I think I'm just going to head in the direction for contract negotiation and bring you guys back in when we arrive. All right, guys, we're back, and at the first terminal... I think this is what the the north one 
So let's head inside here. Looks like we got a security officer we got to handle to get to it. So let's uh, just do a little bit of stabby stab right in the back to start things off. Like so. Oh yeah, you're taken care of real, real quick. Goodbye, friend. And slice the North Public Terminal. Right here. Looks like one more kill. And we will have... The, we will level up to level 23. And I'm sure there will be another guy guarding the next terminal that we'll have to deal with. So let's deal with him. Doesn't seem like we have any uh, bonus exactly for this mission right now. Let's uh, take out the security guard, shall we? Stabby stab! And we have leveled up to level 23. You we have me. anything to learn? Anything cool? Nope, nothing new just yet. Forgot to mention that after the last episode, we had some points. Where is that again? I keep getting lost about where things are now. Uh, combat proficiency. So I put in our other uh, utility point into chem resistant inlays we get another one at level 30 and next level we get fatality so very very cool stuff let's hack into or slice into the southeast public terminal right meow gotcha one more left and we're good to go can we sneak right past you wow that is a horrible horrible security officer Sleeping on the job. And we did it. Return to Watcher X. Let's just grab this uh, slicing guy there. I always like to get the slicing leveled up. Very good. Alright, so is there a fast way that we can go back to Watcher X? I don't remember exactly where he's at. In, okay, I think I remember he's up here, right? Intelligence post. Somewhere over there, maybe? Hmm. Uh, let's just go right here. And we'll be able to figure out where we need to go after arriving here to talk to Watcher X and complete contract negotiations. Okay. Well, 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 we're back here. Where do we need to go? Oh, contract negotiation, high profile ward taxi. So I'm going to travel in that direction, guys, and bring you back in when we arrive at Watcher X. All right, we have arrived at the cell for Watcher X. We're ready to turn in this mission and see what he has to say. Welcome back, Cypher. Glad you could visit. Most people in Shadowtown seek escape. Spies. Assassins. Freedom is the only reason they'd help the Empire. But Imperial Intelligence isn't offering me freedom. You know why? Uh, tell me. My only concern is our work. Intelligence isn't stupid. Uh, tell me. I was wondering about that. Imperial Intelligence is scared to let me free. But the Watchers know that if I refuse to help, my mental conditioning reacts. If I disobey a superior, I get headaches. They last for days. So I may as well help you. The alternative is less pleasant. Uh, yeah, sounds like it. Is that, uh, conditioning common? I'm sorry, and good to know. Is that conditioning common? Has intelligence done that to anyone else? Oh, yes. But I know you're eager to get back to business. Now that we have surveillance, I've been able to monitor Verve Gen's activities. The results are enlightening. Nice. As we suspected, they're manufacturing Cyclone. In fact, Verve Gen is preparing a large quantity of serum for transport and distribution. Okay, uh, terrorists at work. What else? I could have guessed that. Uh, ter <clears throat> uh, let's see, terrorists at work? They're transferring the Cyclone to other cells in the network. 
That's exactly right. Vervgen's day-to-day -day management is expecting a visit from the owners. That's when the cyclone will be turned over. Security will increase. Employees sent home, holocams activated, internal defenses powered on. But get into the meeting unnoticed, and you'll find the terror cell leaders. Okay, time for an ambush. I can be careful, or finally some progress. Uh, time for an ambush. Then we can eliminate the terrorists and destroy the cyclone. An appropriate solution. But the approach will require delicacy. With effort, we can create a cybernetic disguise combining armor, implants, and holographic technology. You would appear to be a class 5 droid. Hmm. Most security devices don't screen mindless droid workers. Fitted with such a camouflage system, you could walk into Vervgen unmolested. Alright, is that safe? Or are you joking? Alright. How do we get this working? I've already assembled the system's components. All that remains is to implant the cybernetics necessary to hide your life readings. I can put you to sleep with an anesthetic before making the incisions. Otherwise, we can begin. The procedure should be swift. Okay, put me to sleep. I'm not sure about this. Or absolutely no anesthetic. Um, I don't know about him putting me to sleep. Uh, absolutely no anesthetic. There's no way I'm letting you knock me out. As you like. I'll go as fast as possible. Sounds good. Oh. Ouch. Painful. There. I've inserted three implants along your spinal column. The Ooh. pain should fade quickly. Congratulations. From now on, you'll be able to pass as a machine. Sounds good. Uh, let's move. That's so weird. Or this is it. Uh, let's move. We're losing time. What's next? It won't be long before the cell leaders arrive at Vervgen. I suggest you get to the meeting. Eliminate everyone. Afterward, I'll contact you for confirmation. Good luck, Cypher. Okay, sounds good. So, contact negotiation complete. Experience points, a good amount. Influence 850 with Kaleo. Awesome. Uh, got some leggings here. Which might be... Looking good on Kaleo, actually. Level 54. And she has, what, level 50 ones on her right now? I might as well put those on her. Oh, yeah. Those look good. I like it. So, yeah, I think on that note, we're going to go ahead and end things off here for this episode, guys. We'll jump back in to finish things off in the next episode. And hopefully be done here on Narshadar in the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of Star Wars The Old Republic. If you did, then don't forget to show your support and tap that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss on all the daily videos. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. And as always, don't forget to... Live long and prosper!